Hi guys, happy Saturday. It is a rainy, dreary Saturday here in Atlanta. I am, um, I just came in to chat. I am um, on my way to go and pick up my, one of my girls, a birthday present. Um, her birthday is today. And so, um, we are all going out today. So last night I washed my hair and I conditioned it and I put in the, um, what did I put in my hair? The coconut oil. And so I have my hair twisted, but, um, my plan was I was going to blow dry it. Well, yeah, blow it straight, do a blowout and put it up in a bun. But now that it's raining, I, I knew it was going to rain, but I thought it was going to rain later on in the evening. So now I'm like, I have a dilemma. I'm like, do I still do that? And I guess I could. I can just blow it out. And um, hmm, I don't know. I was going to, um, I don't know if I still should or should I put on a hurt. And I really, I think I want to, I think I'm going to just blow it out and put it up because I have had on a her for the past um, two weeks and my hair it, it needs to breathe so I did my yesterday I mean tomorrow is actually supposed to be my wash day but my, my hair my head was itching so badly that I, I just couldn't so I did it last night and I deep conditioned it very very well and so, um, I was going to, so, because that was my plan. And, um, but, you know, things changed. So, I am just leaving the nail salon. I got my, um, got my fresh pedicure. And I needed it. I had not had a pedicure in probably like a month. And, um, and the lady, the technician who, um, service me today she was excellent she oh my goodness she was so good my feet they look and feel like brand new money so I got that done today and um, you know I, I typically I would go I wouldn't have gone this long but I have not you of course I hadn't had my feet out with all this snow and so they've been in boots and socks and I'm like I didn't need to do that but I really did I know Mr. B probably thought he was in the bed with another man with some rough feet and I felt that I was like girl you better go take care of that so I got that done and um, so today for my for my friend's birthday we are going we are going pole dancing so we're taking a, a pole dancing class and it's just all of us girls all of um her girls and um which majority of them are my girls too so we're going to a pole dancing class and so i am actually i'm going to i'm going to go look for her a gift last minute no her birthday was this time last year year before that and she is just like really one of those people who is hard to shop for I guess she, because she says that I'm hard to shop for also but um she is like a gourmet uh oh she is like a gourmet chef I mean literally she can really go to um go like head to head with those people on food network she is one of those and so um Are you stopping traffic? Yeah, she is one of those. So, um, I would typically get her something that would be um, food related. And and she would like that. She, she really would. And had I thought about it yesterday while I was downtown, I would have gone maybe to Williams-Sonoma um, to look to get her something because she likes all those different marinades and um, different types of sauces. 
I'm trying to think. I have a, a Williams Sonoma. Let me see. Is that yeah? I do have a Williams Sonoma near me. It's not that far from me now. It's just do I want to ride down there? We're gonna see how what I find. If I don't find anything, I might go get her something like that. But part of me wants to would like to get her something like that from something from Williams Sonoma. Um, or I don't have a Surla top near me either, but somewhere like that, I would like to get her something from there, or I would um, get her something for herself. So I don't know. We're going to see what I'm going to do. I have until about four o'clock and I think it is, it's 12 something. I think it's about 1230. And um, yeah, I'm going to go and do that. And then I'll go back home and blow out my hair. And so I'm going to JCPenney because we have to wear something form fitting. And so I have on these pants that I will probably wear. And they're just the um the workout like capri pants. And I want to find me a cute top to wear on top of this. And then we're gonna have one, and then we have to wear heels. So I have my heels ready and so I just need to know figure out what I'm gonna wear for the other part and um, yeah so that's gonna be fun so after we leave there we are going out to dinner and um, knowing Andrea is probably gonna be somewhere fancy and that is fine because you don't always want to go to the same types of places and you want to have different experiences long as we don't go to one of those um, places where the the items are like really small and so you have to have like different courses to get full uh, and all the, the plates look real pretty so I'd um hopefully I'm gonna it's her birthday birthday but of course I'm gonna voice my opinion but whatever she decides is fine with me so I'm going to do that and then I guess later on I'll come well I'll come home and I have some some video or some footage to edit and um yeah that's pretty much my my saturday in a nutshell is is i have not a lot going on and um i went to my weight watchers meeting this morning and i did i lost 0.2 pounds and i was like okay so when you think about 0.2 pounds 0.2 pounds is like a stick of butter so is it yeah it's a stick of butter so I lost a stick of butter um, this week which is fine with me because anything that's off is is good I'm going in the right direction and actually I think I lost more than that and what I should have done it's like when I got in line all of a sudden I had to go to the bathroom so I think had I gone to the bathroom and got that off of me it would have been more but that's okay next week it will be more and I know what I did this week um, so that the the amount wasn't as much as I anticipated and that was I did not eat all of my points um, it was a couple of days I, I just didn't I just did not eat all of my points and I felt like I ate too much and it was like a couple of days I had points left over and yesterday last night I ate a muffin a muffin excuse me it was a um, banana nut muffin from Sam's well one of those is oh, how much was it? I think it was 18 points and I had 14 points left no I had my dinner I had 14 points after dinner for dinner I had the Sarita's um, burrito from Chipotle that's what we had for dinner last night so I had that that was three points and then the the, 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 the Sofritas and so I had the Sofritas um, the tortilla was something and then I had a little bit of guacamole 
and I had the right. So it took up the 14 points and then I went two points into my reserve points. And then a couple of days I had points that were left over that went into my reserve. So I ended up with like 50 something points um, this morning. I mean, well yesterday, yesterday in the evening. So I, 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 I it was a lot of points that I did not, I did not eat. So, um, this week, I think my body probably thought that it was starving, and I just really felt like I ate too much food, and it's amazing with this how many foods are zero points, and, um, and when I, I'm eating it, I'm full, I'm like, it's no, it's no points, but I'm, I'm just not getting my points in. So, um, I am going to focus on getting, eating all of my points this week. And getting back on track I also did not do any activity this week either and actually today after my meeting my I was gonna go and walk around the um, track by my house and it was too cold it, it was and I, I figured okay and once I warm up I would you know I would be okay but it was cold this morning and I, I just couldn't I couldn't I began to walk and then I just turned back around and walked back to my car I got in the car and I came home and made breakfast and then this morning for breakfast what we had I had um oh I'm sorry oh, excuse me I had scrambled eggs with a little bit of cheese and I used my um my non-stick spray um butter flavor we had scrambled eggs we had ham my mom made a ham last weekend and so um, I brought some of the ham home and sliced it and I just um, um, sauteed it in some of the, the non-stick cooking spray and we had that I had some two point um, the fit active bread from Aldi's and with a little bit it was probably about because it I don't like like globs of jelly so it was like a real thin layer of jelly on the toast and Mr. B wanted rice so that's what we had for breakfast and um, that was six points so I still have what 25 what I have I have 19 points left for today so whatever I eat for lunch um, before we go because we're not meeting we don't have to be to the studio until 5.30. So I can eat me a salad or something for lunch. And I might get a, a chicken salad so I can get those points. No, chicken is zero points. So I'm going to have to get find me something that has some, that's filling and has some points to it. So I can get these points in. And so, um, and then whatever we eat tonight for um when we go out to dinner so i should be i should be good and actually i probably need to figure out where she plans on going so that if they have a menu i can look it up and i can kind of um determine what i want to ooh, what i want to eat and um yeah so guys that is all that is happening my way i figured since i was riding um, leaving the salon and going to um, my shopping center, I would just um, log on and chat with you guys and just see how your Saturday is going. I hope you guys, wherever you are, that is sunny. And um, oh my goodness, speaking of sunny, yesterday it see it was yesterday was it was so so, and but the sun was bright shining brightly at one time and you would have thought it was so warm outside it was chilly it was so chilly and so but I just can't wait till we get to the point where um it's like spring it's funny like after Christmas I'm over winter I'm, I'm over it you know give me a week or so after Christmas and I'm, and I'm done so I'm ready for um spring and I've started spring cleaning different areas and you know after um christmas i begin to purge and i take all that stuff to 
the Salvation Army Goodwill or have the kidney fund come and pick it up. But now it's time, you know, I am doing the, the little areas in each little room and um, finally the guy is going to come and start painting the hallway and then we're going to have him paint the, um, the bedroom. And so I will begin working on the bedroom finally and what else i think that is it he should um the painter should be done he's working on a big project so he should be done he said in about two two and a half weeks he thinks and so then i am next on the list and mine is just like on the side because i really don't have like like i said that hall way in the foyer and my bedroom is all I want him to do and then the areas in those other rooms where we could not reach up by the ceiling that's all we want him to do but the price that he is giving me thank goodness um is 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 really good and you know I've seen his work because he works he does the painting for um he's my um paint guy for my building so yeah he's he does really really nice work and actually when I moved into my office he was the one who, who painted my office so yeah so guys um, that's it I just really wanted to check in with you guys on this Saturday thank you guys um, for all the comments on the haul that I just did it, 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 it the, the entire house is really beginning to look different it's looking very different and um, it's looking really really nice I must say that I am falling I mean I, I always loved my house you guys know what my issue was with my house and Mr. B speaking of that he's talking about now this morning because we were watching um who was watching not the chew the no it's the, the cooking talk show that's on um the food network the one with Sonny Anderson on there we were watching it this morning. We watch it every Saturday and Sunday. We watch the Food Network in the mornings while I'm making breakfast and while we're eating. And we were watching. And today they were doing like Super Bowl um, party type food. And out the blue, Mr. B's like, I'm thinking about having a Super Bowl party. Huh? Really? Because I asked him about that a couple of oh no i'm going to see but i'm sorry i'm going um i was going i'm so used to going that way and i forgot i was going to jc penny's um i asked him a couple of weeks ago about the super bowl party and he was like he didn't think he wanted to do it and you know and, and it's on sunday and you know he just gave me like all of these excuses well today he's like I think I want to have a Super Bowl party, which is fine, but dude, I don't like doing last minute stuff. He knows this. So if we do it, um, that means tomorrow and next week, I am going to have to um, go out and uh, first I'm going to figure out what we're going to have, and then I'm going to have to go out and um, do all the shopping and stuff. and. I don't know. And then and now he he wants he's at home now. He's shampooing the carpet. So